Welcome to Why Do We Do It? The Classic Man Edition. Classic Man. You can see, you can see all the gents. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Dapper. Yeah. Yeah. Represent. Represent. My name is Tony. I edit and shoot for Why Do We Do It? And I'm opposed to dictatorship. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter what you think. JP. <laughs> I'm JP. I support the dictatorship. A benevolent leader. No, it's not wrong, man. I'm Samora. I support our venerable leader. I got support, guys. I'm like Kagame yes, or some guy. It's a big deal. It's a big deal. As soon as this that one decided. Hi, guys. I'm Jomo, aka okay, Martin Jones, aka El Chabino. Okay, okay, enough shout outs to you. Okay, eh. <laughs> don't, don't drop your two times. I'm not going to drop at you. Hey, guys. Follow me at. Follow me at. Anyway, um, I'm the girl mixing noise in the background. Oh, I do it and I support the dictator. See, yeah, yes. Hi, I'm with you. I I do cool. I I fund calls silently so the dictator should be wary. He's the guy with the armband. I should be watching him. Yes, cute. Just the guy with the armband. Hands off our elephants. And now for Dark Man X, Magunga Williams, blogger. So um, I'm a contributor to Why Do We Do It, director, I'm part of the dictatorship. Okay, so first we're going to talk about suits and we have our very own designer and designer. Uh, what should we say? Designer. He's not a tailor because he doesn't do the tailoring but he designs. A suit, the first thing you should always check for is uh, fit. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter whether you're wearing tweed, whether you're wearing nylon or anything. <laughs> as, long, as, long as, the is not, as long as the fit is not good, it doesn't matter. The suit looks bad on you. It doesn't matter. You should be the one who decides what you are to wear. No. But you know there are also some things that are just universally bad. <laughs> like like, like it, you might like but it looks bad. But like for who? If it is good for me, why is it? Why is it? Why is it? Why is it? Like it, 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 it can look, it, 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 you can be very comfortable with it and all that. But you see, it looks bad. The moment you wear something. Guys are going to form uh, opinions about you at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. So if, if you want to look good, maybe if you want to be comfortable, you can look comfortable when you're naked. For suits, it's all about the fit. Yeah. Doesn't yeah. matter, you can sugarcoat it the way you want it, but if it's not fitting, it's not a good suit. At what point does it become form following function or function following form? Because I like to think for men's clothing, mm -hmm. it should always be man, form follows function. As far as I'm concerned, your suit should not limit you from living your life movements. So that speaks to form, following function. Yeah. And it also so speaks to where you get your suits from. Yeah. Like if you get a suit that fits your shoulders, but then it means that you can't like raise your arms. If you get your suits from Mount Apparel, Yes. Shameless product like this. We're just going to put a whole yeah. thing yeah. down there. Mount Apparel. Yeah. 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 I don't have to come and do measurements for you as long as I have to know. The first, pla uh, the, the first part which is supposed to fit is your shoulders and your chest. Mm -hmm. The rest you can live with it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because it will automatically come. I know there's mm -hmm. like stuff about like your the, the cuff of your of your shirt is supposed to reach a certain point. And yeah, it's supposed oh, to reach okay. the mm -hmm. yes the bone on the mm -hmm. side of your arm. That's mm -hmm. where your cuff is supposed to yes. reach. Mm -hmm. And then your suit should be, I think, not mm -hmm. more than an inch. Okay, Basically, wait, how, how, how mine looks. Yeah. <laughs> this is a good example. Oh, no, no, not really. Oh. 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 That's oh. Oh. The show is over. 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 The show is The 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 is Whatever is, is, is showing here oh. is not supposed to show here. The same length showing here. So it's like a ratio. Yeah, oh. so ah. so Information that we don't know. Why do we do it so that you The color length and the cuff length. He said it yes. better. So yes. And yeah. at all points, if you're wearing a watch, you should always, uh, you should always, it it should always show the watch mm -hmm. and a bit of your shirt, oh, it like a bit of maybe. Maybe, yeah. Maybe. Yeah. Would you gentlemen wear a jacket with shorts? Yes. Yes, I would. Yes. yes. Well, you got bad legs or no? <laughs> so I'm 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 good. I'm great. Man, I have my square and bell man. From CIA. So, yay or nay? Yes. 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 It depends on the weather. 
Because you can't just wear shorts anytime. And if you're going for dinner, don't wear shorts. Farel wears shorts. But Farel is Farel. Farel is Farel. Farel is Farel. Yeah, but that's what I said. When you're Farel, you can wear shorts. You see, no, you see, that's what I said. When you've had like multiple, multiple, multiple albums at one grand. That's it. I'm a Janua, that is it. Yeah? Look at Samora. Hold up, niggas. Hold up, niggas. He's wearing shorts. And he's wearing boat shoes. You understand? If you give this guy a yacht, he's at in his element. What I'm saying is there are some places he can't go. To. That's what I was saying. Don't yeah. wear shorts if you're going to dinner. Yeah, but yeah. Don't wear yeah. whatever yeah. you want, so long as it makes you feel good. Thank Period. you. All I'm saying is, is Yeah. That's when you get well fitted. When you wake up in the morning, the, respect the weather mm -hmm. and the person you're going to meet. That's true. No, like, respect you. yourself. Um, but it's about context, it's about it's not just about respecting yourself, as you said, it's about respecting the person you're going to meet. There's places you're going to go. Like if I'm going into work or I'm going to a meeting, there's the underlying expectation that you're either going to be fully formal, so in a full suit, or partially formal, depending on what your job is. Yeah, it's yeah. fair enough to say that, be comfortable all the time. And that, that works, if you're Fahel. Mm -hmm. If you don't have a day job point. where someone yeah. expects yeah, you to dress a certain way. Yeah, but you see now that you're bringing in the element of rules and regulations. At work, there are workplaces where you are expected to be. But that's in. what we said. It's about feeling good. In a well tailored suit, well fitted, you look very good, you feel amazing. It's not a lie, it's true. What Mabunga is talking about is, I think, more, more specific to women. Because guys generally don't wear things that are uncomfortable. In my experience, yeah. it's like, yeah, this suit is too tight, just loosen it up a bit. Okay, you're gonna mess with the fit, okay, just loosen it up and make sure it looks the best it can, you know? Chicks, on the other hand, is like, it looks good. We're good also, too. guys, guys have, have this thing where they, they, they want to do anything for sex. And sex is fun and everything, but you don't need to lie for it. Every time I meet a girl that I want to have sex with, I don't beat around the bush. If you want to get to know someone, it's not, it's, it's not always about the sex. It's not you're trying to get them in the bedroom. It's like, okay, you want to watch a movie, let's go do that. Yeah. You come, movie starts, after 20 minutes, Jay Shahan's up. And no, the Fanta, the Fanta, no. You don't need to be lying to a girl like, oh, I'm going to love you, I'm going to make you babies, I'm going to give you chicken. No, 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 no. Like, listen. Honestly speaking, honestly speaking, supremely dumb. Yeah. We lie all the time. Yeah. All the time you want to have sex. Sometimes you have to lie to for you to have sex. Why do you feel the need to lie to have sex? This is the thing that guys misunderstand. You want to have sex, you're assuming that the woman doesn't want to have sex. Well, Everybody likes sex. sex. If you don't like sex, then that makes you free. asexual or some other kind of sexuality. Heterosexual people, or homosexual probably, people, they like sex. Or you're probably just doing it wrong. Oh, you're doing it wrong. Guys, don't do it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> do better. Do better. Really, yeah. I understand what she's saying though, because guys have this, this mentality that to have sex with a girl, you have to lie. And the only way to change that assumption is, I think, both genders have to be able to admit, like, yes, I enjoy sex. I do want to have sex. Does it make a girl easy if she has sex with you, like, on the first date? No, but according to African society and Kenyan society, it does. Can I say that is a very offensive statement? At yeah. least I find it offensive. Yeah. The idea that someone is easy. Mm. Because the underlying statement, what you're saying is, I think we're vilifying someone who wants to have sex. At the same time, we're admitting that we all enjoy sex. We really? can't have it both ways. Yeah. yeah. I, I, if you I, enjoy I sex, I don't, I don't, I, and I have, like, that. if you have sex with a girl on that. the first day, don't call it easy. Call it a good time. Kitabo, to be honest, it used to be like if you have sex with very many people uh, for a chick, you're a slut or a hoe. But nowadays, that mentality is changing mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. it is changing. I'm not saying that it has changed. I meet a chick. I, uh, I meet a chick on the first day, and she gives me two dicks. I'll take it. It is never walk of shame nowadays. It's yeah. just tried of pride. <laughs> but but only tried of pride. You should not be ashamed of having sex. I feel like also the. the Community and society we live in is like sex is bad, sex is this. Listen, if you didn't have sex, I wouldn't be here. Yeah. The Bible, the Quran, all these other books, they're like sex is good, you should do it often with someone that you love.